Hey everyone, welcome back to My Apple Zone, and in this video I'm going to show you how to install multi-touch gestures on your iPad 2 or your first generation iPad. So let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is make sure that you have iOS 4.3 installed on your iPad 2 or your first generation iPad. Once you have iOS 4.3 installed, you can then go ahead and download Xcode 4. And you'll do that by going to the Mac App Store on your computer, and then you'll download Xcode 4. Xcode 4 is a $5 application for your Mac, so you'll need to decide now if you want to spend $5 for the multi-touch gestures on your iPad. And it's also a 4 gigabyte download, so depending on your internet connection, it could take quite a while. So once you've downloaded Xcode 4, we'll go ahead and begin the installation process. So the first thing you want to do is launch Xcode and then uh, plug your iPad into your Mac and when you do that you'll get a window that looks just like this you just simply click on use for development it will ask you for your developer login if you're a developer you can uh, enter the uh, credentials to log in or just simply click cancel and you're done it's that quick it takes less than 10 seconds to um, upgrade the iPad to the developer version of 4.3 and now you have multi-touch gestures installed on your iPad. So just simply disconnect your iPad and start using your multi-touch gestures. So that's how easy it is to install multi-touch gestures on your iPad. That took less than what 10 seconds to do. It cost you about five bucks and now I'm going to show you how those multi-touch gestures work. First you can easily swipe to access the uh, multitasking bar up and down, up and down. You can switch between applications. So here I have Safari open uh, as well as the uh, camera application that you were just watching and I'm going to scroll to uh, the preferences pane that I have open uh, I have uh, the YouTube application open. I'm going to go back to Safari, scroll back to the camera application. Of course you can scroll up, up and down through the pages in Safari. Then I can scroll, I can quickly um, gesture and get back to the multi-touch or the multitasking bar and then just switch between applications really quickly like that. And then of course I can pinch to close the application and brings you right back to the desktop. So installing the um, uh, developer version of iOS 4.3, again, relatively easy. Go back to the camera application here really quickly. So there you have it, you guys. Multi-touch gestures on your iPad 2, your first generation iPad. Pretty easy to do. If you guys like this video, please click that like button. And until next time, guys, I will talk to you later. Bye.